Good morning, Saturday morning. Our adventure begins on the Adriatic Pearl, our Croatian cruise for the week. And here we go. Boarding day has arrived, the Adriatic Pearl. Going on board. Okay, this is the moment of truth. We get on the boat. Here we go. They moved us to cabin 18. Oh, down we go, down we go. Cabin 18. Is. Wow, chocolate's on it there. Look how nice. Look at the bathroom here in the well. Check it out. Adriatic Pearl, triple room. And now we're going up to the top deck here. This is where we uh, some of our meals, the bar, the lounge area. A little 360. Well, we are finally aboard the Adriatic Pearl, and this is our view from the top deck. And we are off. So long, Dubrovnik. Cruise begin. We are off on our cruising adventure in the Adriatic. No Asia. Captain Nicola. Uh, yeah, also. <laughs> uh, but on this cruise, except for the God, uh, the most important is our head chef, Matko. Lots of tools. Today we are going to have a tasty part uh, and taste the product. And uh, inside the museum you can buy the... We are approaching our first island, Kukula. Nice day, Kukula. We are going alongside this boat right now. Kukula, let's do a little matter up here. And we are docking right alongside this boat in Kukula. Here's Kukula town. It's pretty, another walled city. Look at that. We're into the old town right now. One of the hidden doorways. There are eight towers remaining of the twelve. And if you steal one of those jars when the liquor is done, you can have many happy hours. <laughs> <laughs> or you can see what we call the loggia. Good morning, it is Sunday morning, our second day on the boat, and we are headed to Puchka, where we're going to visit some stonemasons. The coastline here is really pretty. Hopefully, if the weather holds out, we're going to have a little swim break soon, too. Beautiful coastline. There he goes. Oh, I heard it's freezing. Love your tears. So we're cruising along the Croatian coast. Oh, the Puce. We are entering the harbor of Kujitsu. This is a stone maker's place. The White House is built from stone here in Kujitsu. So this is the town of Puskala known for its limestone. Famous stonemasons here in the town of Pushkala. Well, we're docked here in Pushka, so we're gonna go for a little walk before the tour. A cute little town. Here she is, the Adriatic Pearl. That's our boat in Pushka. Look how pretty this is. I'm gonna take a tour of a stonemasonry school here in Pushka. So they usually, on the first year of their education, the, the first thing they do It's 5.30 so we're in happy hour time. We wander around in the nature and then we are getting back on the boats and back in Omish and back home. Today is Monday morning and we are headed to the town of Omis. We're going to take a boat ride in the river and then we're going to end up in Split, Croatia today. Another beautiful sunny day. A little, little breezy out today, but nice day nonetheless. Off we go. Slight change of plans. We are in Split. We're supposed to be in 
on this on a uh, riverboat cruise today, exploring uh, this, these nice canyons. But due to the uh, rough waves and the howling winds, we elected to come here a little er earlier. So we're going to explore the town of Split, one of the largest in the Dalmatian coast. Split. Well, we just got here, but already shopping, shopping. Here's a 360 of produce, jewelry, you name it. As far as the eyes can see, in the old city of Split, it's shopping. So we're now in the old city part, the medieval walls. We're going to have a tour of that a little later. But while we're walking, so we have these beautiful alleyways here. The old city. Digidero. The Aborigines Digidero. Is it smelly in here? We are in the fish market. This is our actual fish market where all the day's fish are brought in to catch in the seas. And all fresh and smelly. The fish market. Here's how they get the goods to market. Is that cool or what? It's lunchtime. Or the Adriatic Pearl. We've got pasta. We have some lettuce. And most of the buildings are dating from the 14th and 15th century, so during the Venetians, uh, but they were here on, uh, on the tower. Uh, so everything from the Diocletian Palace to the fish market, you can read by Diocletian or Diocletianus. As you know, Dalmatia follows a Roman. So here's a little video I'm going to pan out here to show you there's a boat, Adriatic Pearl, and this is where we are. Split Croatia, hiked up to this viewpoint. How's that for a view, huh? Split Croatia! Lily is relaxing, she's tired because we just hiked all those steps down from the harbor. And there's our boat, there's the Adriatic Pearl way down yonder, see that? We hiked all the way from there. Split. Well, this is the Strato on a Monday night. Very festive. Good morning. Today is Tuesday, May 14th. Another beautiful sunny day in Croatia. We are in Split. We are headed today first to the fish market and then we are off cruising to Havar. Sounds like a beautiful, charming town again. Here we go. So we are all headed early morning around 7 a.m. to a fish market. We were at yesterday, but you catch the early morning fish. Construction. Um, this resembles well, St. Mark's on Square in Venice, right side, built by Napoleon. Fish two days ago, that's scorpion fish maybe. Oh, yes. So we have one small example here. The red one here, you can see it. Uh, wow, you had, now you have a chance to see one of the pearls of Adriatic in terms of uh, really quality fish. This one here, you can approach a little bit, you can recognize it by black black spot here. This is John Dory. John Dory, excellent, really quality fish. You see the eyes? Yeah. Really strange fish. Can anybody see? So this is the fish market, and here we have the tuna, which is pretty incredible, just like wicked tuna. Look at this. This guy is perfectly suited for the task there. There's the fish head. Look at that knife. The tuna. Wicked. Break through the body uh, of the goat or sheep, and uh, then they are roasted. Now we're at the produce market. Lots and lots of fruits and vegetables. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Colorful produce market. Well, so long split. It's been great. Fun, fun time. Nice, nice little city. Split. And so, goodbye split. We are off to Havar. Next stop, the Adriatic.
we are approaching Var, H-V-A-R. How pretty the coastline is as we approach Var. Mediterranean-like, beautiful water. So now we're approaching Var. Look how pretty this is. Very, very Var. Coming into Var. So we're doing a little walking tour of the town of Var. Really, really pretty. One of the prettier towns on the Croatian coast, the Var. Uh, so, uh, during your free time and later on while we are going to do a walking tour, we're going to do a walking tour. It's a shopping frenzy here for these uh, Chaska necklaces. <laughs> So this is what these towns are kind of like. As you walk up all these narrow little alleyways, there's restaurants everywhere, bars, a lot of greenery. Just beautiful. So once again, we're doing another hike, walking up to this fortress, which gives a nice overlook of the uh, town below. And already, you can see a target starting to uh, take some shape. Look how pretty this is. Right? And upward, upward we climb, another hike. But look at the views here. Let's check this out. Huh? Look at this. Over down, down in Havar village. Very pretty. Look at the other islands out there. Blue Adriatic. Havar. This is nice. From the fort. So there's our boat, the Adriatic Pearl. From all the way up here at the fortress. What an outstanding view. Havar. Here's a view from up in the fortress, down on Havar. Deep blue Adriatic. This is really pretty, huh? Bar, Croatia. Beautiful views of the bar. There's the fortress. And another little pan of the harbor of the bar. And then more. Well, this is a beautiful view, isn't it? The Adriatic. Beautiful views of the harbor at the bar. So long, Havar. It was a great, great visit. Great day. At last, we're approaching our next destination after Havar. Bella Luca. We got detoured here due to the high winds. We aren't supposed to come here, so this is a little bonus, an extra port. Bella Luca. Bella Luca, our port for the night. Bella Luca. Large harbor. Singing, uh, our sea love, wine, enjoying life, Dalmatian, and also a hard life in Dalmatian. Good morning, Wednesday morning. to walk in depending on your speed. After that, from the small lake to get to the small bridge, or in Croatian, Mali Mos. So everything with Mali means small. So we're walking here in Yulet Park to a couple small lakes. I'm gonna take a boat across. There's a little island with a small church on it. Yulet Park. Now we're on a boat trip to the small island. We are sure of the island. 
So now we're headed on a trail back from the lake, and look at this view though, uh, as we're hiking along the lake here. How beautiful the colors, I wonder if it's coming out. They're all different shades of greens and blues, just beautiful on them. So we're about to go for a swim here at this uh, really pretty hotel. Look at our view here. Just gonna pan around a little bit. The colors of the water are just it's amazing, look at this. That's where the ladder goes in. Beautiful, a little 360 here. The pool at the hotel. And there goes Lee venturing in. It's pretty cold. How is it, babe? <laughs> it looks so nice, though. Look at that. All right, there's Jeff. Gorgeous. There's the Adriatic Pearl. It feels good when you're in it now for a while. It's really refreshing. Yeah. Awesome. Enjoy. Just zooming in on the water. The color, the clarity of this water is incredible. The clearest water I've ever seen. All in Croatia. Well, it is one o'clock on the button, so we've left Niet. And we are on, off to the island of Shipan, where we will overnight. So off we go to our next island adventure. And now it's time for lunch. And this is what lunch looks like. How's that? Lunch aboard the Adriatic Pearl. Don't ask me why, but the captain has turned the boat over to Jeff. Why we don't know. But so far, he's riding the high seas. When are we doing, Captain? We're doing great. We're doing great all time. I think everything's going to be right on schedule. Excellent. And look at our view. Pretty good. That's where we're headed. That's it. All right. See you later. See you soon. Shippon, the town of Shippon. This is where we are for the evening. Quiet little fishing village. It's a today is Thursday, May 15th, and we're approaching the town of Solano. We'll tour the town a little bit, and we're going to go on a motor coach tour of the town of Stone, which has large medieval walls right here. Here we are in the town of Solano. We've been walking around, taking some photos. Small, peaceful, quiet kind of town. Nice grand hotel here. A couple little marketplaces, there's bars. And this is it. This is the entire town of Solano. We're going to uh, see all of the three really, um, well, the most interesting things about Stone. Uh, first of all, are the stone bands the oldest uh, silk uh, working in Europe that were built there in the 14th century. And actually, just because of these... Uh, so he is uh, the actual director uh, director of uh, this, these old pens. So he would like to wish you a very warm welcome uh, in, in the town of Stone and these... Uh, we are in the town of Stone, S-T-O-N, which is known for its famous salt ponds. And it's one of the largest in the Mediterranean, and I think one of the second largest in the world. Here's an example of some of the uh, natural salt that's gotten out of these salt ponds. Essentially, the Adriatic comes in here, and through a series of gates, uh, the water's evaporated, the salt water, and uh, based on a certain concentricity at the time, they get the salt right from the uh, right from the sea. Also, it should be noted in this town of Stone, uh, it's named also for these uh, walls, second of which, second largest in the world other than the Great Wall of China. They built these walls, over seven kilometers of walls, to solely protect the salt. And about five kilometers of the salt of the uh, wall still remains. And so the climb begins, up, up and away on the city walls of stone. There we go. All the way up. All the way across. So and we're making our way up. Puffing, puffing at a time, but going to get up there to the top. And this is some of the view we're going to be seeing. Look at this. There's the town of stone below. There's Hi, Adriatic. 
And here, some of the salt ponds right there. I want to say hi to the stones from stone. From stone. There's your place, guys. So down there is that little salt cart with the salt pans. Now we're going to zoom back. There's the town of Stone. There's the Adriatic leading to it. And here's the wall with Lee. We're up top. Now we're going to tour a vineyard for some olive oil and mostly red wine. Vineyard. And so the vineyards are the red grape and everybody is using the same variety of the grape. So Plavac Mali is the variety of the grape that everybody produces here. If I translate correctly in English, it would be something like the small blue because the grapes are very, very small, very dark on the back. Okay, we're gonna eat some oysters, so we love the love. Uh, funny thing is the guy from the salt pond is the guy in the oyster place here. Oyster, yes, he won a gold medal in London, 1936, for oysters. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. It's oyster time, babe. Oyster time. There's some fishy fishies. Look at all the fishies. Wow, look at this. Oysters. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Famous for its culture with more than 90, 90 different species of the animals, of the shells. There you go, oysters, baby. See some wine and bread. There's Jeff eating his oysters. Fresh. His glass of wine. So good. Good morning, Friday, May 17th, a rainy day as we head back to Dubrovnik, our last day at sea. We are leaving the little town of Slano, and there's our harbor we're leaving behind as we head back to Dubrovnik today. Oh yeah, look at this. We are really rolling here. Big swells coming in. Oh, oh. Here's a shot out back to show how the ship's rolling and rocking. A little more peaceful going this way. Not too nice a day going into Dubrovnik, rough seas. And alas, we're back in Dubrovnik. Go to dock, do some laundry, and then check out the old town, Dubrovnik. Dubrovnik. 